at the end of this tunnel. It's not a mystery. It's not angelic. It's not God. It's not goddess. It's nowhere near divine. It's human. Flesh and bone. Fragile glass wrapped in apples pulp. It's just, it's just a woman. Six blocks ago, I was happy, smiling about nothing, excited to just be sharing your time. Five blocks ago, I didn't have a black eye. Four blocks ago, I had all of my hair. Three blocks ago, none of my teeth were loose. Two blocks ago, I became a murderer. I killed you 67 times in my heart. So one block ago, I decided that I was gonna leave your ass until forever. Now I'm standing on this corner. Nothing more than bruised fruit. I got four directions I could go in, but the only one that seems remotely appealing is the one that drags me right back to you. So two blocks later, I'm standing in the place my heart first became a murder, wondering how everything I loved about you has now become the exact same things that I hate. As you stand there 10 feet away and the look on your face says, I knew you'd be coming back, but I didn't come back to you. No, I came back to the place where my heart enjoyed murder so much that it repeated the act 66 times in my mind. I'm still trying to figure out why my body just turned the other cheek. And then I realized that so many of us don't want to seem weak, so we rush from girl to woman as our mouths claim that we are more than a woman, a princess, the queen, a goddess. Your countenance changes as you finally realize the air of your ways. You take time to read that look on my face and it says nothing about me coming back to you. No, brother, I'm long gone. My anger just drug my body back here to test and see how much more than a woman I actually want to be. Do I want to be more than a woman enough to slit your throat? Princess enough to wipe the blood from my hands onto the shirt that she bought you. Queen enough to decide what to do with the bloody mess lying here at my feet and goddess enough to dig that trench to bury you in. Check the creation of the one where she formed your ass from mud. You see, unlike me, the goddess was never above getting her hands dirty. Maybe I'll plant crimson apple trees across your grave until I have a bushel of apples for every bruise you gave me as you lie there rotting beneath your last mistake. And no, I won't expect this fruit to fall far from the tree. You see, it's a nice consolation prize to some woman actually bearing your seed. Yes, there is a light at the end of this tunnel. It's not a mystery. It's not angelic. It's not God. It's not goddess. It's nowhere near divine. It's human flesh and bone, fragile glass wrapped in apples pulp. And it's lucky for you that I've learned to become content with just being this woman. Thank you. Yeah.